Tim reporting for our news. It appears as if we have a train that caused a major incident after criminals were trying to mm. steal precious items from a security truck. And, unfortunately, they miscalculated the center of gravity of the train, and they were able to be caught because the train wrecked. More on the story. Let's go to Jennifer. Well, this has certainly been an unusual incident because the train has been proven of its reliability around this turn. Let's watch a video of it's working perfectly. No problems. It just had a little tip as it went around the turn, but no problems. However, the one that crashed was very different, and we have no idea what caused it. Here is a recording of the train that fell. Notice the cargo pod at the top. Here we go. Oh, that just crashed into the house of the well-to-do person. Watch it crash. Oh, that just went around the turn. Why did the train with the cargo on top fall over, but not the train without? The answer is center of gravity. In this photo, this is the picture of the train that fell over. The orange dot represents the support base and the fulcrum. The green dot represents the center of gravity. That's caused by the cargo and the cargo pod that's above the train. The blue line represents the slant at which the train is at. As you can see, the green dot is past the support base and is over to the left. That will mean that the train will fall and is very unstable. However, in the second train, the center of gravity is much, much lower than the train previously. That will mean that the center of gravity is to the right of the support base and the train will remain balanced. It will not tip over. Well, I don't know about you, but I certainly learned something from this video. First, an object will remain balanced and stable if its center of mass is in a vertical plane with its support base. Good job reporting that, Jennifer. An object with a lower center of mass is usually more stable than an object with a higher center of mass. You know, I could really see that when I saw those nice diagrams of that train falling over. Well, I guess that concludes our sciency outing. Hope you learned a thing or two. See you later on news.